Hello. And uh, happy 4th of July. Happy Independence Day uh, to my fellow Americans um, and to the rest of the world. Uh, watching it in other countries. Uh, I hope you're all having a good day. Um, obviously, Independence Day here in America is uh, quite a big holiday. Though, of course, you know, uh, being 2020, it's going to be interesting to see how this whole day goes about. Um, you know, with, uh, <clears throat> with all that's been going on. It's quite interesting, to say the least, especially with how it's always going to be. Uh, as far as um, uh, I was uh, aware, I was going to hang out with uh, family, uh, friends, but you never know. Sometimes things change at the last minute, especially with things like that with with going what's going on in the world uh, but things are declining quite a bit uh, here in America so at the very least that's good I would say uh, one thing I will definitely do is uh, watch a movie on uh, today uh, Independence Day uh, Although a lot of people watch the movie Independence Day, and for many years I did too. Um, but I don't know, I, I've gotten uh, into a sort of a, a recurring uh, tradition of sorts, where now every 4th of July I uh, watch this uh, Inky Doodle Dandy, uh, you know, James Cagney film. Um, now I'm sure I've said before, that uh, I'm not a big musical guy, and uh, I've always maintained that. I'm just not a huge fan of the musical genre. Um, obviously, there are musicals I like. I mean, and Yankee Doodle Dandy is one of them. Uh, but, you know, this is just a film that, you know, uh, George uh, Cohen, he was a... Uh, yeah, he was uh, born on the 4th of July, though, as a, uh, as, you know, as time's gone on, it's said that he actually might have been born on July 3rd, you know, maybe minutes or even an hour before July 4th, but uh, he's always adopted uh, July 4th as his actual birthday, like he never saw July 3rd as his birthday, and that's kind of interesting how, you know, you're born the day before, but <laughs> you're not going to acknowledge that at all, even if things prove otherwise. Um, you know, this is a, this is just a film that's just quite good, it's also very, quite patriotic. Uh, I might talk about this one day. I don't know in the near future because, well, I still want to kind of talk about some more gangster films. Uh, I've been sort of being in that mood. I've been rewatching some lately. Uh, so maybe next week I'll uh, talk about one. But yeah, uh, 4th of July, uh, sort of a tradition I've been doing. So regardless of what happens uh, throughout the day, I'll, you know, whether or plans follow through of spending some time with family and friends, you know, unless something happens, uh, all is a go, so, this, uh, uh I'm, I'm sure the day will be good, no matter what, uh, usually is, I, uh, I've always, uh, have fond memories of Fourth of July. Um, um, now I know for those who aren't um, American, you know, it's just another day. Uh, but you know, 
because America's Independence Day. It's the day we celebrate the independence of uh, uh, America, the United States of America, if you want to call it that as well. Because, well, it's, that is what the country is, uh, the name of the country. Um, but, you know, we celebrate our independence. And what better way than to blow up stuff? It's the American way. Um, though, I have, I have a feeling fireworks and getting things like that might be a bit difficult this year because of everything. Hopefully there'll be something. I mean, I've heard fireworks, but there's wasn't really much of a big thing with actual buying of fireworks. There wasn't a huge selection anywhere we can go and buy some stuff for shooting off at night for the 4th of July or anything, so, you know. But that's, that happens. Um, yeah. At least I'll have my tradition of watching this, which I, again, I don't know. I just sort of wanted to do something a bit different. Um, usually before, you know, I'd watch, like, Independence Day on TV, or it kind of became a tradition. Like, it doesn't matter if you actually you, know, you own the movie on Blu ray or DVD, if it's on TV, just watch it. Uh, however, usually it's uh, censored and cut up, so it's kind of a big bummer. Uh, and I know I have a Jaws shirt on, but you know, it's summertime. It's a summer film, so it makes sense, I think, to have this, though. Of course, I'm... Uh, this is being recorded at night, but, you know, probably wear a more of a, like, flag shirt. Uh, uh, la uh, later in the, in the day, morning. Hmm. Words are hard. But yeah, uh, to everybody who, who's here in America, uh, to those who are Americans but are overseas, but elsewhere in the world, happy 4th of July, Independence Day, uh, and to all those who, you know, uh, don't celebrate Independence Day because you're not American, uh, again, I hope you all have a great day. Um, it should just be a day where everybody can just, just have a good day, you know. I mean, it's summer, you know, summertime should be good, even in the midst of all of this nonsense, craziness happening. Uh, you know, summertime, people should still be able to enjoy themselves, um, even if you're limited to do certain things with what you're able to do, yeah. enjoy them. Uh, maybe you'll find something that you enjoy doing quite more. Um, so, like maybe you might pick up uh, pick up a hobby that you used to have or did, but then for whatever reason, maybe life got in the way, you can then pick it up again. Perhaps you could just do something like that and have fun that way a bit today. And then barbecue or whatever, if that's what you're going to do. You know, it's interesting how in America uh, our thing is we eat. So it's, a, it's an interesting sort of tradition we have. Um, though some people just eat obscene amounts of disgusting foods. Like a combination of things that just should never go together. Uh, that's a, an incredibly small amount of uh, uh, of people, but unfortunately, pictures or video of people eating disgusting combinations of food uh, seems to be uh, it's what Americans eat. No, it isn't. I remember months back, I saw a 
some disgusting looking shaker smoothie or something. It was just like a whole bunch of disgusting foods and drinks and like I don't I, just actually just thinking about it is just disgusting. I don't even want to. I don't even want to re relay what it was. It was just. It was just revolting to look at. I'm like, that's just, no. This is not what Americans eat or drink or whatever you do with that. I mean, it was in the glass, but at the same time, it's like supposed to be a beverage, yet it was also uh, thick enough to where you could actually, you know, actually eat it. Like, get a spoon out and eat it. I'm like, no. That is horrid. That should just never exist ever. That, that that thought of mixing all that together and putting it into a glass should never have crossed that person's mind. That's just horrible. Uh, so I think in the tradition of eating, you know, burgers, hot dogs, you know, whatever, things like that, grilling out. Uh, Uh, eat ice cream later, or pie, or whatever. You know, eat food you like. And uh, while he, people may be a bit more limited this year to celebrate the Fourth of July, which I know in some places that that is happening, uh, which unfor is unfortunate, but. Yeah. I mean, I guess you can still do stuff, even if it goes against what certain politicians say, but, you know, you know, if you do that, well, just be aware uh, that somebody could snitch on you, and uh, cops could be called, and yeah, that wouldn't be fun. If you're gonna do that, then you know, be be sure you're gonna be okay and just not be be be, be, be safe and uh, yeah. I also knew that I also found out the Iowa State Fair is not happening, so that's uh that's a first. Um, it's also one of the few times. My state is actually seem to matter in this country. You know, one of the few times ever in of the year. So it's interesting. So for a full year, I guess we won't matter uh, or be in the thoughts of anybody. I remember at one point it was said to be like the greatest fair in America. It's interesting. Uh, like a lot of people from various states come and uh, just see Iowa and the fair and everything. Remember one year, uh, people from Germany came over. That was interesting. Um, but yeah, the uh, 4th of July and just summer in general. Things either aren't happening this year or you're limited to do stuff that you normally would do. Uh, regardless, uh, hope your 4th of July is great. Hope your day is great. If you don't celebrate it, and uh, see you all next time.